Hello, welcome back to Let's Play Metroid Fusion. I'm k 161 and this is the 6th Sector Nocturnal Sector. We've just learned that this, there's a new type of X in this sector, a Frozen X. Apparently, they were changed by the cold, and <clears throat> and we use... They were changed by the cold, and now they and now they, we absorb them, they freeze They freeze it from the inside. <clears throat> and and they, that hurts us. It does 30 damage. Again, what the heck is that? Uh, one second, folks. Uh, see you in a little bit. Sorry about that. My controller got screwed up. I have no idea why it does that. Whatever. <clears throat> Moving on. And this is the only type of a special X you ever see. There's never a heated up version. There's never a cooled down version. There's just there's just this one cold version. This is not turn sector, it's pretty dark in a lot of places. First off, bomb, bomb, two bombs here, and we find an opening. To a missile tank. There's nothing to the left there, it's just it's just to show you a glimpse of, of the missile tank. Right below, right below this sucker. <coughs> Ow, sorry, I've got the fog in my throat. And move on. And now you see our first, meet our first looks. Now, not only is it is it the only special X you ever see, it is the only enemy you can stun. The only enemy. Every other enemy, the beamer that does hurt them or doesn't, beam stuns them. Which doesn't make any sense. Oh, and don't worry, I can't do anything in these areas until a bit later. Oh, and beware of these things. The breakable and inside them a lot of times hide hide the blue X. Like, oh, and these X will actively hunt you. They will act, they will try they will go out of the way to try and absorb try and get, get you to absorb them. Uh, don't do the bottom one, there's an X in there. Move down here, blast through here, so I don't have to fight as many enemies. And skip a... Skip those X's. Ah, ah god damn it. That was bad. Anyway, take a running stuff in this area, and avoid... Ignore these guys, because you need speed boost right there. And drop that. Ah, fuck. Get, get away from me, get away from me. Uh, so the right here is, is uh, past these suckers out. There's a safe station, I'm going to blow them because I need a little bit of health. Yeah, and if, the, and if the blue works are ever swarming you, just go in any door and then exit out. They will be where they started and they won't know you're there. I don't know. Makes no sense, but I don't, a lot of stuff in this game doesn't. Anyway, you get a free energy tank. Another couple of bombs, and you fall down. Come on, fall down. Is there something else on here I thought? Maybe, maybe there's, I don't remember, whatever. And we fought, we won't fought out here. We meet no, another sector. Now this time we have to be very quiet because we meet another, because we meet a friend back here. Shh, it's the SAX. It will kill us. It, it will kill us. So be quiet. We don't want it to know we're here. But yet we're following it. I have no idea why I'm doing that. Yeah, watch out for its power bomb, and it, you have to stay way back here. It's the only class spot doesn't matter. This is for the footsteps. This is for the jump twice. I think you can go around here. But be careful. See, right there, there are breakable blocks. If you, if you walk too fast, you'll it it will fall down, and you will see it. Wait for it to go into the door. And now you're free. See? This is this is a trap here. If you move too quickly, that sex will see you, and it will kill you. But now that you've moved, it isn't here, and it never works, and you won't see it again for the rest of the sector. Uh, it's two paths here. I guess there's only one. I think there's something else. Never mind. Okay, then. Moving on. Safe station to the right if you need it. This is, this is more of the black hole black area. Shit. Uh, there is a way to, do, to go through that without getting... At least in a single blue wax, but I don't feel like uh, doing it. Doing it, so I just want the monster to. Big guy. Oh wait, isn't that only for one of the boss people? <gasps> when did it, but wait, by a data room. Boss fight in a data room? Not quite. X apparently. X apparently had the ability to absorb data. It's. Difficult enough to understand why Samus's bio suit can absorb data, but an, an, a core X? What? What? Anyway, this is your next boss fight. It, it came a big bocce ball. This is what I like to call it. Um, this is not hurt it. You have to use a beam. 
It has little, it has little balls that will protect it. Protect it once, but you can destroy them with your beam, and then they will not grow. So yeah, just wait. These are strange. Just wait for it to come in and blast it. But because when the when the getting card that doesn't work, because it will because the balls will protect it from most any attack. So you have to just go after it from the beginning, and then just stand still and wait for it to come to you. See, I can just stand here and, and it will attack me, and I can just blow it apart. That's how it usually works. Ah, dang it. Uh, oh, I guess I heard it enough. So after you heard it enough, it becomes a church to regular core X, and then you just add the vulnerable missiles. So I don't get the core X. The data made it vulnerable to made it immune to missiles, but vulnerable to beams, and that when it shrinks back, it's vulnerable to only to missiles. Okay. I don't get that. Another thing, how fast these these courses get stronger. Now, I'm using super missiles right now, and uh, right now. So each of those missiles I'm blasting with is equal to three regular missiles. The very first boss we fought took took what took three missiles. This one took six super missiles. That's 18 missiles total. Oh, how fast these things are getting really strong really quickly. Anyway, so now you just up the virus data. You can't be frozen, and you can uh, 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 survive in extreme temperatures. However, you can, however, you ever exposure to the lava still hurts you still. You don't get immune to that until the gravity suit. So, some reason. Anyway, now you can absorb the X, so they, they recover 30 HP instead of the regular 10. That's a bit weird. Okay, that's a bit. Ah, fuck it. Moving on. Fast forward. Oh, and that's the one time they will. That, that is the only time they will now willingly go after you. And from now on, the blue will try to avoid you. And if you get this missile tank, and you ready to move over, because there is a secret right there. Voila. Um, it's, there's a missile tank in the ceiling, I think. And you get more missiles. So now up to 110 of these suckers. Like I said, then they, now they'll try to avoid you. They, you can still start with your beam and absorb them, which is a neat trick because they do because they do because uh, they do recover 30 HP instead of 10. Like I said. Anyway, moving on. It, okay then. Now we're back here. Now we're back in the first in this area. You have to go back around because you have to. Because ah, you have to go. Because you have to go move back up here to grab this. Like I said, the bottom ones are next. And now, this way you only find blue X. There's also now real enemies because now the blue X can't hit you. Somehow they figured that out fast enough and we and we made it so that you can and and multiply the forces in these areas. Now oh, be careful of these suckers. The, the puffers thing, they're like puffers. Whenever you hurt, you whenever you hit them, they smell gas. Oh my god, I'm, my aim's terrible today. There, I hit it. Overkill, I know, but I don't care. It's fun blowing stuff up. So like I said, here before there would only be a blue rush, but now there's real enemies too. Not too big, but still. This is making this game go a lot quicker. The speed runs just blow everything up like nothing. Okay, then. and we are back in the navigation room. Okay, then. and we talk to our computer now. And it wonders the same thing we're doing. How in the hell did it download it? Yada yada yada. Talks about gibberish. 
yeah, yeah, yeah. It says the, the, the plasma beam might. It says the plasma beam might work, but they, but they can't absorb, but they can't do it. They won't be ready for that for a while. And but in order, but in order to combat it, we they now are gonna give us ice missile data. It since a uh, current cell you make can apparently do can apparently use um uh, ice beam. We get ice missiles instead. Neat little trick. So why it's any, any different? I don't get. It. I don't know. Maybe it's because the ice is in the missiles themselves and not in our beam. I don't get it either. Anyway, so anyway, moving down to the fifth sector, sector five, which is a cold sector. And I will have to cut it off there, folks. So see you next time on Let's Play Metroid Fusion. Bye.